Hello everybody, last time I left y'all while I was uh, picking up all the extra stuff that I had missed. Well, turns out I missed one, and it's a secret one. And I did not know about this until a few weeks ago. Or, I mean, a few days ago, I'm sorry. Uh, well, joining me today also is my friend Kaylee. Say hello, Kaylee. Hello. She, uh, she and I met on League of Legends. And she's a really awesome support player, and she kicks ass, and she's just really fun and nice to talk to, so I figured I'd have her join me to see how this works out. So here's the code from uh, last from last episode. We're going to go from that. Alright, so the hidden item is on armored armadillos. So there are tricks to it. Yeah, the boss of this guy's name is Armored Armadillo. So the uh, few things you have to have, you're going to have to die a few times, so you need the life. You have to have everything in the game, like everything 100%, beat all the bosses. And this is probably the reason they put this weird live bat here. So what do you think about the live bat? Doesn't it look different? Like everything's a robot, and then all of a sudden there's a live bat. You there, Kaylee? Hello? I can't hear you at all. Is the music... It's just like you're silent. Like it's muffled and then you're silent. Oh, that's not good. Uh, do you know what happened? Like... I don't know, because, I mean... Yeah, it's just like, now you're fine, but... It might be the game volume. Yeah. You think that might be it? Probably, because, like, if you're fine now, you were fine before. You might have a ah! Oh, you just called me fine. You are fine. Hee hee hee. Alright, so... Well, hopefully that doesn't mess anything up. Alright, so, uh, you actually don't know much about the game in general, right? No, not at all. Alright, so, yeah, she's a youngin, she she grew up before, or after this game came out. What was the systems you had, uh, growing up, if um, any? I had a Game Boy Color, and then, like, the first version of the PSP. Game Boy Color? Oh, man, I didn't reach that, I didn't get one of those until I was, like, 12, 13. That would be about right. Ah! Oh, those spikes will kill me. Okay, so, ah, good thing I get, like, immune when I get hit. Alright, so this was way back before the Game Boy Color. Well, not too far before it. Ah, stupid guy. I think I read the original came out in, like, 1997. Oh, okay. I have no idea when this actually came out. Uh, I made that jump. Alright, so... It's probably going to take a bit, won't be one of the longer videos I record for this. Okay. I should be running through it, there's no reason, but I mean, I want to give you the full, uh, fill of the level. Oof. Okay. So spikes are obviously instant death, and that thing on the upper left is such. Alright, so, um, okay, I just need to... Oh, I have special powers. Okay. Like, you get them by beating bosses. Okay. What special powers do you have right now? Um, alright, I'll get... Okay, there we go. Okay, so I have... First one is, uh, homing rockets. They go to, like, they'll home in on whatever bad guy. Let's see. And you can charge it up, actually. Mm -hmm. And then it'll shoot four homing, or five homing missiles. This one's a fun one. When you charge this one up, you get completely invulnerable. And you can shoot, uh, it shoots one and then it turns into three. Alright, so here's the, uh, alright. So the trick of this game is, uh, 
Anyway, okay. Uh, you have to die right here, but you have to see that piece, that thing that was up there. Like, it's one of those health things. There we go. That. You have to see it, and then you die. I'll, what I'll do is I'm gonna show you the things as I go. I'll, like, I'll die to kind of keep it moving forward. This one's a rolly shield, but it's uh, charged up full. Gives you a full shield. And this will actually block any attack, any small attack. But like if I was to bump into him, he takes more than one hit, so it would uh, kill it. And there's a fire, a freaking flamethrower. That's all it is. Yeah. But you drop a thing, and that'll go... Like that'll go until it hits, comes to an end. Alright, this is Tornado one. I like the tornado one. It's fully charged, it's just like a actual tornado. Ah! Oh my gosh! Alright, well, I guess I'm gonna finish this because I have to show you the uh... There's a boomerang. The last one is the one I need, actually. This one will actually pick up stuff and bring it to you. Alright, now the ice one, you get it by beating a penguin. But, the last ice one, you can freaking ride. Nope, didn't make it. Okay, so, there's that. Are we restarted over here? Okay. So I didn't see it that time. Like, I got there. The whole trick is you have to, uh... Oh, sorry. I stopped talking, to be honest. The whole trick is you have to see it. And it's, uh... You have to see it five times. And, uh, the five times have to happen when the game is not, uh... Like, you can't turn off the game and then do it like, do it twice and turn off the game, then do it three more times. So that was two right there, because I didn't see it that last time. I'm going to see how many men I have. Okay, I have enough. Alright, so that was two. Alright, this is like the basic X-Buster. You shoot the little lemons, is what they call it, then that thing... And then you got a bigger one, that. And normally that's where it stops. But uh, there's an item you can do to level up your gun to be able to shoot this one. Which, um... Ah. I don't know. You need to be talking some more. You're not, you're not talking very much. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Hi. You need to be talking more. Alright, so there was three times. Okay, three times. Alright, so what's your initial impression of the game? It's it's interesting. I don't know. I've never. I mean, it's kind of like, yeah, you know, but it's kind of like you know that's descriptive. No, I, I, I use that for a lot of things. This is actually faster. I should just be going in front of them. But it looks interesting. It's very, you know, obviously Mario last. A lot of games were in that time. Yeah. I was never very good at Mario. Oh, Mario's fun. Alright, so this is... Is this three or four? Uh, I thought it was four, because you just had three. Okay. Okie dokie. Alright, so one more. I don't know if it'll be there this time, or if, it, if I have to die the fifth time or not. And I like to uh, point out, you have to have all the capsules and all the hearts. So you have to like play through the game, beat every level, and you have to uh, come back and do this. You can't. Although if you like don't turn off the game, the very first time you get here, it'll count that. Oh, it's there. Okay. So these are the power-up cap capsules, and if you notice... The Dr. Light, I believe that's his name. He's mm -hmm. uh, wearing a Street Fighter outfit. 
Alright, why don't you read what he says? I give you a special present. Now enter the capsule, please. <laughs> Alright, so this is a special power that I never knew about until a few days ago. He lets you shoot a Hadouken. And, alright, the rules to be able to shoot the Hadouken is you have to be at 100% full health. You can't have, you can't be hit once, and it's an instant kill on anything it hits. Oh, and your feet have to be firmly on the ground. Okay. I love how he says it too, he just sounds so cute. <laughs> alright, I'm gonna go ahead and finish out the level. So this password is 3676-4627-5142. I hope y'all enjoyed this video and learning this new trick that eluded me, even from one of my favorite games. I'd like to thank Kaylee very much for being my guest speaker, and hopefully she'll be back for the rest of the season. Uh, y'all have a good night and enjoy.